did you do the work of this relatively incomprehensible um, playwright that that was often done for the elite and in ways that were very elite and elitist and didn't speak to ordinary people. <laughs> I am the one who will be. My flight is the rebellion. My sky, the abyss of tomorrow. And to me, what's so beautiful about his, his, his work and his plays is that most of them are about that. They're about the failures of progressivism. They're about the tragedy of people who you know, fought and died to make revolution, to make a better world, to free people from injustice, and failed at that. What was our mission? What was our task? What was to be done? Whatever happened, the play is about revolution. It's about black revolution. And it's about how these revolutions, they weren't for black people and they weren't for poor people. I free us of our task. You, Gallo Decker, the peasant from Brittany. You, Sassportos, the son of slavery. Me, Debussy, the son of slaveholders. Each to his own freedom or slavery. Our play is over, Sassportos. The play, um, references numerous revolutions. The revolution of 1917, the revolution in Russia, the revolution in Haiti. You know, again, I don't want to make a universal blanket statement, but too much revolutionaries um, wanted to change the world but didn't actually create those efforts for the poorest of the poor, for the lumpen proletariat, for the, the people who were most despised and hated, and that they had a disdain for those people as well, and, and they didn't organize them as they should, and the revolutions weren't for them. And I think that the black caste has something very particular to say to America and the world in 2010. They make something clear about that in their performance of this play. You can put an image of one of the characters in the play on the chair like Huey Newton, you know, to speak of now another revolutionary moment of the 60s. But those revolutions, they, they didn't work. They didn't work for the black community. They didn't work for the black poor. They weren't for them. So I think a black cast makes that statement and I think a black cast at Castillo makes that statement. It seems fine to cast black actors performing Death of a Salesman or, you know, some of the traditional classics that have been done by white casts. Some wonderful productions have been created, but this is different than that. This is a different kind of thing.